The environmental impact of the textile industry is a serious global challenge that scientists around the world are trying to solve. Growing cotton and uh, transforming it into textiles uses immense amounts of water, which is ecologically unsustainable. And for this, we want to find an alternative from cellulose, from the wood industry. Demand for textile fibers has grown tremendously over the past 15 years. Currently, more than 100 million tons of textiles are produced in the world every year. Most of the textiles we use are made from oil. The second largest raw material is cotton, and about 6% of textiles are made from wood. Over the next 10 years, demand for textiles will grow by 50 to 60 million tons per year. Cotton production cannot be increased from current levels. And in order to prevent the growth of oil-based fibers, we need to develop environmentally friendly methods to produce fibers from renewable raw materials that do not produce, for example, microplastics in washing. Of course, textile fibers have been made from wood for a very long time. However, traditional methods, such as viscose production, are highly polluting, and therefore there is an urgent need to develop alternative processes. In Finland, research in this field is very advanced. Together with his team, Professor Ilkka Kilpelainen of the University of Helsinki has developed an environmentally friendly alternative to dissolving cellulose, ionic liquids. Ionic liquids are salts in liquid form. Esimerkiksi selluloosan liuottamissa on se, että nämä pystyy hyvin tehokkaasti kilpailemaan vetysitoutumisen kanssa. Eli selluloosahan on tämmöinen hyvin pitkä lineaarinen polymeeri ja se sitoutuu itsensä kanssa hyvin tiukasti niin sanotulla vetysidoksilla eli ei kovalenteella sidoksilla. Ja nyt kun meillä on esimerkiksi tässä tapauksessa asetaatti anioni siellä, niin tämä asetaatti anioni pystyy kilpailemaan hyvin tehokkaasti vetysitoutumisen kanssa ja sen takia ne on hyvin vahvoja liuottimia esimerkiksi tämmöiselle selluloosatyyppisille materiaaleille. The first pilot plant to manufacture textile fibers with ionic liquids was opened in 2020 in Anakoski. The pioneer of the method, Professor Herbert Sixta of Aalto University, aims to develop the properties of fibers and the recycling of chemicals in a new pilot plant in Otaniemi. The ion cell team is now focused on solving other challenges related to processing of wood-based fibers. To uh, compete with synthetic textile fibers, we have to improve the mechanical properties of cellulose-based textile fiber. The Infinited Fiber Company has launched a textile fiber that uses so-called cellulose carbamate technology in its manufacture. It dissolves cellulose or textile waste in urea, after which it can be spun into new textile fiber. The textile fiber in Finna, manufactured by the company, is already on the market. Since the beginning of 2021, clothes made from it have been available for purchase from H&M Group's weekday online store. The reuse of textile waste plays a key role solving the challenges of the fashion industry. Sustainability of fibers is not only rising from the raw material, so the fiber as such is just the one third of the sustainability of the textile life cycle or less. So the next one, which is about the same size, is the coloring and finishing and chemical converting of the fibers when they are already textile fibers. The textile fiber company Spinova, on the other hand, has a very different approach to the production of cellulose-based textile fibers. Their innovative method mechanically converts pulp directly into textile fiber using 99% less water than cotton production. In the Spinova process, wood is not dissolved, but very finely ground so that it can be directly spun into textile fiber. Founded in 2015, Spinova has already grown into a 50-person company and is bringing a new textile fiber to the market in cooperation with major consumer brands. At the moment, we are working together with about 10 brands and we have published a cooperation with uh, the Norwegian Vergans, a sportswear brand, and Finnish Marimekko, a fashion brand, classic fashion brand from Finland. 
and also with the Danish bestseller that covers se several brands. The development of new, more sustainable textile fibers is now advancing at an accelerating pace, and Finnish researchers and companies have a strong position in it. For consumers, this will soon make it easier to recycle textiles and make informed choices.